Oh yeah. Sounds savory. <laughs> it is very savory. Very savory. And it's not cheap. Not cheap. It's like a fancy up class, you know, salon. You get to sit down, like chef comes with a menu. He gives you all the different types of salts. You know, you can have ocean salts, sea salts. You can get some table salts. All the different types of salt. He's got some, uh, <laughs> he's got some baby salts, bath salts. I like, you get your choice. Like all the salts that you know are available, made like in luxury style. LOL, I've actually been to a spa uh, kind of like that. Interesting, interesting. Um, but with herbs, oh, okay, interesting. With herbs, well, that sounds like fun. Hope you enjoyed it. That's funny. Ugh, here I was thinking I was just being ridiculous. But I was just being silly. Turns out, it's relevant. I, I fell asleep. Ah, oh, well, hopefully that was a good thing. Could be, right? All right, Amber Acolytes. Oh yeah, it was good. Sounds nice. Sounds nice. Glad you enjoyed it. What if I play the Crown Wars Paladin, and next turn I'm gonna get ready to stun his two guys, you know? And if he lets that happen, then I'm gonna be able to attack with both my Warcry. That's all I'm saying. All I'm saying. All right, you got a weapon? Go ahead, play the weapon. Play it on the same dude, or on, on one of these. Okay, that works too, whatever. Uh, oh, it's bare arms, I forget. I forget these things. No blocks. No blocks. Here we go. Justice Edge. Who do I want to stun temporarily? I'm not even sure. I'm like, if I, either of them attacks, I lose my guys. Which is kind of no fun. Um, attack? No, but if he attacks him, that's, well, neither of them die. But if they both block one, that's when I run into a problem. Not really, actually. Uh, I'm gonna go for it. I'm attacking. Attacking with both. Let's see what he does. <laughs> Hope you like my song. It don't make any sense, but it's still silly and fun. All right, it's just noises, let's be honest. But that's cool too. All right, uh, Primal? Justice, Justice. Now I'll be at three and three for Reyna. You know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about. End turn. I'm hoping he's gonna play that weapon he just made on one of these same two people. Maybe I'm getting greedy. If he plays that weapon on the same two people, then I can use the Entangling Vines and stun them again. But he's not doing it. Oh god, with the bear arms. Oh god, with the bear arms. Um, if I play Mass Entomancy on that, does it keep its bear arms? Probably does, doesn't it? Probably does. No blocks. That's a lot of damage. That is a lot of damage. I feel like I'm just gonna just start stunning, if you will. Boom, boom. Let's see if he blocks me. And if he does, then it's a trade, which results in this tribute right here, which is nice. Ah, uh, but I also need to stun the guy. I'll use the tribute later. I'm just gonna go with the shield bash right now. Shield bash. If it's, if it's a couple extra turns, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. He's done now, and then I'll have to stun him again with the Entangling Vines and hope I get enough for Champ of Order. Kind of a big deal, actually. Uh, kind of a big deal. Three damage, but it happens. Maybe I should wait with this guy to block. Maybe I shouldn't. Um, stun again? Maybe. Next turn he attacks, right? So, probably stun right now. I could wait, but I think that'd be risky. 
How do I get rid of that weapon from this guy? I feel like I'm gonna attack. For starters. I'm like spacing out on this game. Like, what do I do right now? Um, I could play the champ, but that does nothing for me. I instead need the vines to slow him down. I can't have this guy kill me like right now, so. I'm gonna go vines, and I'm gonna go guard dog. Why the guard dog? Because the guard dog is big. Get a big attacker. Pretty much the whole plan. It's just attack big, go big or go home. This Forge Master is seriously a problem for me right now. Um, just a sigil. Huh. Am I gonna die next turn? If not, then maybe I go Mass Entomancy right here. And I go Champ or Bannerman for Justice. Next turn I can play Champ of Order and he can start getting swole. Who's gonna chump? This is the thing, it's like I need to keep at least one of these guys for chumping purposes. Let's do that. Five damage to his face. Boom. We're gonna do it. Can't not do damage, you know? It's like damage must be done. That's pretty much what I'm saying. Ah, uh, Av Avigraft. Avigraft? Avigraft. Who knows how that's pronounced? That's kind of funny that he got rid of that, because I literally only have one of those. <laughs> Gotta block this guy right here. I'm taking four damage, but I don't want to. But I guess I gotta. Don't really want to know how it's gonna happen next. No! 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 <laughs> Uh, champ of order. I wish I could say he's just in time, but he's a little too late. And he's dead. GG, everybody. I have lost this round. No. No. It happens.